So we're using the experimental feature of the containers. And you're saying, how do you use the experimental feature? So if you go to Elementor settings, I love my little pointer, Elementor settings and experiments, yes. This means, boys and girls, when you turn things on in the experiments, it could break. All right, so let's just know that. So in my video where I say don't turn it on, don't turn it on if it is a live public web page because things can break, your site can go down, don't use it on a client site, okay? Until Elementor reveals the um, big party for using containers. So there are stable features right here. There are stable features. Oops, come on, pointer. Stable features, and then there are ongoing experiments. These are the things, boys and girls, you don't want to turn on unless you want things to break, possibly. So here in the ongoing experiments is the Flexbox container. I have it set to active. Um, it may be default, and notice here, status alpha, meaning uh, we just threw it in there and uh, you're on your own. Make sure you have a backup. Okay, good to know. That's how you turn on the experimental feature. Don't do it on a production site. 